I don't know who, who the winner is, Janine. Maybe we're both winners. I think we are. <laughs> Just step back. Just excuse, yeah. step back. Gonna, step back. This is stay in your lane. Amongst these shelves, there is only one thrifter who can call themselves Janine. Me. I couldn't think of anything better than that. <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to the channel. This is Janine, and behind the camera. Hi, I'm Laura. Um, welcome back to Shiny Break Doggo. We're here today at Unique Thrift in Union, New Jersey, one of our favorite places to thrift. We're hoping to find some vintage things, maybe some things from the 90s and 80s. And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button, hit the thumbs button on this video. But let's get to the shelves and see what we can find. Hit the thumbs button. Thumbs button. <laughs> is that what I said? Yeah. Like um, Toys R Us, like. That's, Jeff Jeffrey. Yeah, that's definitely Jeffrida? Toys R Us. Jeffrida. <laughs> is that her name, Jeffrida? Oh no, it's not Toys R Us. No, it's that looks like Toys R Us. This yeah, but Jeffrey was a boy. No, Mac. Jeffrey was a boy. They didn't have a female. That's from Boone. They? they had a female Jeffrey. I don't think so. No, I'm pretty sure they did. This is stumping me. I don't think so. I'm gonna look. Oh yeah, that is interesting. It's like a mirror with a built-in uh, statue for ten dollars. The Ten Commandments. I've never seen anything like that. That is interesting. You know, all these little cases for little things. Shouldn't show Janine that. She'll want to fill them all up. Okay, so we have confirmed that um, Jeffrey did have a sister. We did. Her name is Gigi, but we don't know if this yeah. is Gigi herself on the cup. Also, Janine spotted that this vase has a bunch of vintage Lisa Frank stickers on it. Do you guys remember that toucan? Should we pay $6 just to peel and scrape off the stickers? There are some older ornaments here made in USA, and these are probably like Poland, but they're not in a box that's marked, and there's a broken one there. So... I don't know what to make of that. These are older, but not super, super, like, they're not from like the 40s or anything. You can tell by the glitter. So these are probably like early 70s. But yeah, they're not in the box and they're not marked, so that's unique for you. But I do like these glasses. These are sort of nice. And I really like this one with the Christmas tree for 99 cents. That's not bad. Oh, how interesting. Jean, I know what that is. This is a Napco yeah. planter. Yeah, I completely and missed that. And you're gonna be surprised. <laughs> wait, wait. <laughs> Can I say something? Yeah. I want to say that I sold this. You can't touch it because we're gonna play a game. And I don't want you to see the price. I already saw okay. the price. Sorry, I already saw the price. It's a dollar sixty-nine. It's a great price. Wait, can I just say? Why did you do that? We were gonna play a game. I, my eyes are just that good, no, Janine. No, they didn't know the price. Wait, you wanted me to play along? No, oh, but at least they could have played. But now they. But they know. also could have seen it, like no, I did. They wouldn't have. Okay. Anyway, I'm sorry to spoil the fun, but this is a dollar sixty-nine. A dollar sixty-nine, mm -hmm. and it's Napco planter. You want to get your little grubby hands Wait, on it. I just want to say that I sold one that was red from an estate sale. Do you remember that estate sale we went to? I yeah, found it in nicer. red. This one's in green. It's... <laughs> All right, I'm done. You guys I'm are going to have to wait till you. the end to see us talk you. about this anymore. I'm playing with you. If but I decide to get it. Look at these. Someone <laughs> she made just these. ignores me. What? What is Does that? Someone make these? I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> Stop touching it. <laughs> I guess they did. Yeah, out of paper. Oh, that's, that's, that's not a cool. little creepy. Yeah. Look at that planter. Look at what, oh yeah, look at that. Look at that. RB, is that Rubens? Probably not. Is it in one piece? It's only $4. Yeah. Wow. It's a good price. It's nice. Mm -hmm. Usually these are broken by the time they end up a unique. Or by the time hands. Unique puts them on the shelves. Usually her hand or like the hands are broken. Yeah. But this one's in um good shape. And it's only four dollars. I also did spot this little tennis girl. I feel like they're sort of a dime a dozen. Janine, a raccoon and a squirrel. What? A raccoon and a squirrel. Oh, they're cute. 
fifteen dollars each. They're big. This one's broken. Oh look at it. Yeah, it's cute. So sad. <laughs> Janine spotted one of my favorite Christmas movies, Nick and Noel. Oh my gosh, this one's from Toys R Us. Is this one of the ones I made you watch? Mm, I think I've seen it. It's a great little, little special from 1993. Oh, I used to love this one. Also, they have the... Um... It's the Great Pumpkin Trolley Brown, which I think we It's have? the Great Pumpkin Trolley Brown, I don't see it. This hurts to put back. What? This Barney out? On Barney waiting for Santa. <laughs> um, tapes that were like all different colors. Mm -hmm. And um, yeah, I loved this. This one. Very nice. There's a bunch of Christmas. Young Frankenstein, Charlie Brown Christmas, Home Alone 3, Frosty Garfield. Snowman. Garfield. Sealed. Sealed. Sealed Garf. Sealed. The, reluct the Reluctant Dragon? What? The Reluctant Dragon from Disney. Never heard of that before. And um, yeah, that's the lineup, folks. Look at all the plush, Janine. Yeah. A lot of them. There's a lot of plush. Anything we seal. Here. El Picasso. Yeah. He's cute. I just knocked off another plush. This little guy. Oh, look who's still here. Ah, yeah. Dill. Interesting. Um, oh, he's only five bucks. Mr. Dill or Mrs. Miss Dill? I don't know. The gender um we'll take a look through these and we'll pull anything out that looks interesting if there is any if not oh wow look mortgage investors group oh i mean you've been looking for that that's exactly what i wanted i found this little garfield in here i think he's newer maybe he was from like the newer garfield movie i'm gonna show janine that's ten dollars now i don't know why what did you find a little bubble blowing machine it's uh, apparently a souvenir drink cup, I think. Oh. But I guess it would blow, you would blow, you could blow bubbles through there. It's really dirty. Interesting. But it's... Is it older? Yeah, it's marked on the back 2003. Yeah, definitely. It's pretty cool. I don't know. That's look at this. Very interesting. Oh, stop it. Janine. I know. I just did this as a giveaway. I know. And I was, and I was, and I was like, I can't believe you're giving that away. Like it was painful. And now you found it yourself. It was Jenny's. And now it's oh. Jenny's. Jenny's. Jen Jenny's. <laughs> Jenny's. <laughs> it also comes full wow. of puzzle. Wow. And two. I can't believe that. Puzzles. That's so fun. Congratulations. It's a dollar ninety-nine. It's not on sale. And neither no. is this. What did you find? And neither is this Garfield. I found. Garf. I think he's newer from like he looks a movie, like, right? Yeah. Yeah. I don't know why the bag's ten dollars. Why is but it ten dollars? I know. I thought you would enjoy it though. Yeah, it's always fun to see a Garf. Can I look at the books without you? Look, he's got. I'm going right now. I'm you already gonna... looked at all no, of this. No, I'm going. I'm... All of this? Yeah. I'm kind of like doing my own thing today. Okay. So, I'm like, are you gonna look at the books? I'm out? just gonna go. All look right, now. I'll come join you. Miniature. Wow. So. Look at this tape. Oh. I know. Ew. Is it marked? Yeah, three ninety nine. Uh, fun for the entire family. I'm sure everyone just stood around the kid building it the entire time. Interesting. Um, what else for the toys? Uh, this Tonka CD wrong game. I used to have one of these. I remember those. It's a lot of games. There is a lot of games. Jitters. I've never heard of that game. Do you guys see anything? They did have a bunch of older games here when we were here like a week or so ago. But I'm not really seeing much this time. TV Guide game from 1984. That's sort of cool. $4. Wow. Look, Janine. TV Guide's TV game from 1984. Oh, wow. Isn't that cool? 
That is really cool. I bet we wouldn't be that good at it. No, probably not. But yeah, that's really <laughs> cool to see. Yeah, that's wild. Wow, old Sealed. PC games. Sealed. That reminds me of like Dinosaur Tycoon. Did you play that? No. Oh, so fun. Or maybe it was just Zoo Tycoon and you and could you have dinosaurs. Have yeah. Dinosaurs. Oh my gosh, I loved Zoo Tycoon. But like, how fun is that? It's like, that cool. is fun. Janine and I were going to go look at the books together, but then we separated before we even got there. But I went. Uh, she let me go before her. And I only found two spooky books. I found two spooky books. Goosebumps Most Wanted and this Monster Party book, which I thought was pretty cool. It has like this like hidden holographic Ooh, 3D fun. thing on the front, which is sort of fun. And I bet it's probably from like the 90s if I were to guess because of that. But let's see. Ooh, it has them all throughout. That's sort of cool. Is there no date on this? Maybe in the back. That's a pretty cool book, Janine. Yeah. 1099, 1995. Originally yeah. published in Great Britain, 1995. That's cool. Yeah, it's 1995. That's a cool one. That's pretty fun. That's Do you um, want it in the card? Maybe. Maybe. Also, I just go. noticed this. Slush Hill decor. Decor. <laughs> decor. Decor stamps and stencils and right from the 90s. Extreme 1990s. And you get the paint that you need. Authentic. The decals. For any Gen Z kids out there who want to paint their room in authentic 90s uh, celestial graphics, this is the this kit. Is it right here. Yeah. Look what you found. A Jurassic Park. Yeah, it's a modern car. one. I've been wanting to find like the metal ones. Older ones? No, they have, they made like uh, die cast ones recently, mm -hmm. but I always find the plastic ones, and when I find the plastic, they're usually broken. Mm. Um, this one isn't broken. It's only two dollars from twenty twenty. That's pretty cool. These are two really pretty glasses. They're ninety nine cents, but I don't know who the maker is. If you guys know, leave a comment. I thought they were really pretty. They definitely look older, but I don't know anything about them. Look what I found, Janine. Two of these little trinket boxes from Claire's. Oh, yeah. Remember these? Yeah. For six dollars for the two, I had so many. Me too. Right? Like, you just couldn't have too many of these. Especially when your sister worked for Claire's. <laughs> and what's fun about these is that you'd flip them over and they'd have these little bobbly things on one side. So fun. There's no collectability in these, really, though. Oh, it smells like something's in there. Well, now I'm curious. Um, what did you get over here? What did you get here? A little alien guy? Oh yeah, I want to show you that. He's clearly older, right? Yeah, and the other stuffed animal? Little bunny? Yeah, she's older too. And a bear? Yeah. Cute. Look at this from 1995. Oh wow, nice I spy. Puzzle. That's so fun. I didn't know they made uh, puzzles. I didn't either. Well now you know. Yeah. What's that? On the toy aisle. The children love children love little broken, broken glass pieces of glass. <laughs> they love to put it in their mouth. Yummy, yummy. All these Nancy Drew books and Ghost Lover. Are we all just ghost lovers at the end of the day? Where are we going now? Furniture. Where? Furniture. To look for what? Furniture. We're looking for furniture. Furniture. So here's what the furniture looks like. Not very exciting. This is nice though. It's writer's desk, I guess. And then it's also all this other stuff. Sometimes you find some cool vintage chairs up here. Um, or some funky lamps, but never anything too exciting. For a second I thought this was old, but I don't think it is. What do you think, Janine? Oh, I like that. Yeah. That's fun. That's fun for $6. I do like that. I wonder if this is from like the 90s or something. Or not. Oh, yeah, or maybe. Definitely. Yeah. Oh, uh -huh, that's so fun. Yeah. that's. I'm starting to like it. I'm going to look it up on eBay. That is fun, though. I suddenly find myself trying to see if this actually works for some reason. Um, yeah, they're not really on eBay or anything. They've sold. Maybe it, um, once. Do you need to? Yeah. Oh yeah, there's a little switch. But also, it could just be the battery. No, it's true. Or, or the light. 
this plug up. Oh, oh it works. It works. It looks great. That's pretty cute. It comes with a little stand. I don't know what I'd do with it. Light it up and smile. Light it up and smile. It's $6, and I don't think it's on sale. No, it's not on sale, but that's fun. Look at this high chair, guys, for $8. Can you believe that? Oh, those are so nice. There's also, it's funny you should point this out, there's another one that I passed I by. I think I know which With one. the little Starburst motif. Yep. Yeah. This These are really drawers. cute, though. Little jewelry boxes. Where's the other one that I saw? Down there. Down here somewhere, right? It is right there. Yes. This is the one I saw. With the Starburst. It opens up. And it's got drawers. So nice. How much is this? Ten dollars. What were we looking for? Puppy steps. Puppy steps. Oh. Honestly, Hi. the sun is shining on our second spot of the day, Second Avenue, uh, Superstore. First to Superstore. Second Super. <laughs> There's something wrong with me. I cannot speak anymore. Second Avenue Thrift Superstore. You need to read a book. I do need to read a book. That's why we're going to go look at the books. Okay, we're going to look at the books here. Hopefully find some. I already spot something, Janine. Like sticking out for us. Night of the Living Dummy 3. And what? Oh my a Garfield goodness. Treasury. There you go. Look at that Garf. That's oh. a classic Garf. That's a classic Garf right there. That's a classic Garf right there. <laughs> <laughs> We're a little dramatic. We're a little dramatic. This is 2010. Dramatic but fun. Any other goose bumps? When there's one, sometimes there's many. Land of the so Lawn Weenies. <laughs> the haunted car? What? What? I no, got a good eye. Newer, is newer, it is a newer one. You know, we don't just 10,000 ghost stories. 2015. So these are both 2015. Maybe they dropped off some older ones too. We don't know. Horror show? Hey, look at that horror show. The gruesome guess. I am on fire. I'm on the pulse. I'm on fire. You can't stop me. So there's that one. Horror at the haunted house. Yes. <laughs> Richard Peck, the ghost belonged to me. Book of monsters. Stop. It's like, it's like, you're on the pulse. It's like when you're playing those like puzzle video games, you just get. D like bonus after nope. bonus after bonus nope. <laughs> it's like playing pokemon puzzle and you stack up i'm gonna stop talking but yeah look at that we'll take a look I at have, that in a second I have, but i have a um a book like this do you because look at this do you have do you also have critters of the night no zombies don't do windows there you go just, you just step back just excuse yeah. step back gonna, step back I'm this is stay in your lane you retire <laughs> Step back, Janine. Let 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 the uh, experts do their job here, okay? Okay. I'm being dramatic. We're both being dramatic. If you can't tell. What? Talk about experts <gasps> do their job. Stop. Reader beware. She just you just ver Uno reversed me. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. That's funny. What? It came what? from Ohio. <gasps> what? R.L. Stein. This is the book about him. That's a good find. Is Look it? at that. I mean, I don't know. Isn't any Goosebumps book a good find? Here, look what I found. <gasps> Now you're taking his name and name. <laughs> I thought you would like that. What? What? <gasps> Come on. Who's gonna pull ahead? 
Who's pulling it? I don't know. I think you're uh, I think you're catching up pretty quickly though. I gotta find some more. Halloween party from the Black Lagoon, does that count? No. I mean it does, but like It doesn't really count. Okay. Another she one. found another one. one. Ooh, I hate that cover. It's scary. Yeah, I don't really like that. Um yeah, I think that's it. Um, we'll take one more look and show you guys if we find anything else. But I think we're on a nice roll here. Maybe there's some younger kids um, Halloween books. That'd be fun to find too. What? She oh, finds just, another one. Just right here. Is that a newer no, printing? see this one always oh. tricks me up. I always think, oh, this is a newer one. But no, it's not. It is... 1994. 1994. Wow. She did it again, folks. She's catching up. <laughs> Another one? Another modern I gotta, printing. I gotta stick to this area because I was deviating, but this is where help. I found all these. I need help. Okay, I'll help you. Thank you. You're welcome. You. Also, look, I know what you did last summer. Oh, cool. Wow. I was just thinking at Unique how we don't find I Spies anymore. Can you believe that? There you go. Oh. I Spy oh, you're, you're, on, you're literally like on a roll. Are these bonus like, points? Yeah. You were like, oh, I'm done with the goosebumps. Let me pull out the <laughs> I Spies. <laughs> what? Just when you thought what? you pulled ahead. I found two more goosebumps. Yeah, they're modern. But... Are you joking me? Are you kidding? I don't know if I've ever found this one. No, never. I don't know who, who the winner is, Janine. Maybe we're both winners. I think we are. <laughs> but look at this. These were just chilling over on the other side. Thanks. Look what I found. It scared me. Sorry, in this bag I found one of these little guys. Oh, is that a Kurt Adler one? No, it's the Stein. Oh, okay, nice. Yeah, for two ninety nine, and then I found this really cute bud vase, which I really do oh, like. Oh, that's cute. That's two forty nine now. Can I show you what I found? Yeah, I found Baby Olgon from nineteen ninety one Kenner Toys. Mm -hmm. Look at her. She's in pretty good shape She's for nineteen ninety one. Yeah. Wow, look at that. Cool. Look, guys, it's an easy bake oven. So cool. Is this the one we grew up with? It might be. I can't tell. It looks like it. Yeah, it does look like it. Cool. And a Harry Potter and the Surfer's Stone game. That's pretty cool. That looks and older, too. 2000. Yeah, that's like original release. It's on the first release. Mm -hmm. I found a bag of old cards. I found this really cute thing too. Oh, those are cool. What's yeah. this middle? It's Did you see that? Yeah, the cat. It's really cute. Sorry, I'm filming with my left hand, which I don't typically do. Two forty nine. Cool. What did you find? Kenner. This guy's pants down. Nineteen eighty five. Little thing. I don't oh. know what this is from. It's like a diaper. Nineteen eighty five. That's interesting. I've never seen that before. I don't know. Kenner it's Huggins. Kenner Tuggins. You should look that up. That's interesting. I will be, I guess. Janine just spotted this. I, I don't know. Thinking maybe it could maybe potentially maybe be a Mad Balls. Or like a knockoff. Or a knockoff. I'm gonna need, I'm gonna need some help from Laura here. All I do is use Google Lens. Like that's how I, I help know, you. Like you could definitely do it too. <laughs> My eyes are just like not stop it. Janine's eyes are like, zhu, 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 zhu. my eyes are like this. <laughs> Your hair also. <laughs> That's how I feel. Hmm? It's found a bunch of salt and pepper shakers. Oh, in the and the foil. Two turkeys. Two turkeys. And um, Corn. these cute little pigs. Pigs. And then these with a little deer on it. Cute. Huh. Oh. I came across this bag and this thing, I was like, that looks like an animatronic, but it's not. Um, it's That's this thing. That, that That is a thought I, I had. I hate to admit it. But I'm admitting it. Admitting it to the whole world. Um, 
that's a 1980s Gans Wrinkles the Dog, which Wrinkles I guess came dog. in a bunch of plush, but this PVC version is harder to find. I couldn't find too much information about it, but it is very intriguing to me. Um, and I might pick up the bag for $2.50 just because of this little guy. Do you guys recognize him? I don't know, but it spoke to me. This is also speaking to me, this M&M's calculator. I could use this for work. <laughs> when do you ever calculate things on a calculator? Margin. I uh, use my physical calculator? No, not a, that's what I'm saying. I could use this for my physical calculator. Sounds like fun. Instead of using oh, no. the computer calculator. Oh, no. Oh, thank you. Are these little... I don't know what that is. It's a poncho. It's a poncho. Hey everyone, we're back from the thrift stores and we want to show you what we're actually going to be doing tonight over on Whatnot. We are going to be selling a bunch of the vintage Christmas ornaments that we got out of the trash. This is just a small selection of what we have for tonight. And if you're interested in purchasing some of those ornaments or just joining us, we have a link in our description where you can get $15 towards your first order on Whatnot. That doesn't have to be with us, that could be with anyone that you want to purchase from but we do have that link in the description of this video so laura we found some really cool stuff today at the thrift store we did. i'm going to show you some of the things that i found and that i decided to pick up we found so many books at second avenue today um i put some back because some of the goosebumps we have and some of them actually were in that gray of shape there was one that had some water damage on the cover so decided not to get it but what i couldn't leave behind was obviously um the choose your own adventure goosebumps so fun another one we have here is the scarecrow walks at midnight which is actually such a good story in good Very condition creepy. too great condition this one you found more or you're founding so many books i know who won i don't know you guys, you guys decide tell us. yeah comment um, this one's really cute and this one i have another bruce coville's book um I don't know what title it was or is. This is like an infinity like art because the book he's holding is the book. Oh, wow. That's fun. That's really cool. <laughs> it's a great cover too. Yeah. I, I just love that sort of style. And I Spy Spooky Night yes. book. I was just thinking at Unique how we don't find I Spy books very often anymore. There was a time where I feel like I was finding them all the time, but lately I don't see them. So when you came and showed me two, I was like, oh man, this is really Laura's day for finding books. <laughs> so great find, Laura. Had to pick the I Spy up. And then Scary Stories 3. I know, I can't believe you found this one. So cool. This is like, this is, Scary Stories um, is hard to find in itself, but Scary Stories 3, I don't think we've ever mm -mm. found. Um, so very cool and I'm excited that I found it. And Laura, you found me a Garfield book. Garfield Treasury. I love the comic strips every Sunday. My dad would get the newspaper and then I would read Garfield. So that's why I love Garfield so much. And I used to have, when I was a kid, they were the fat cat packs or whatever they were called or something. And they were like, just the comic strips. And I've been wanting to find one as an adult. And whenever I find them, like, they're like really gross. Like one was like all wet one time. Anyway, but you found this one, which is even more exciting because they're in color. The other ones aren't in color. And I don't know, it just really makes me feel like I'm reading the newspaper with the little color comics. Something so. about that like classic Garf. I know. Gets to me. Like, look at him. I wasn't a Garfield fan, but I can appreciate him in my older age. <laughs> the monster party. Laura just wouldn't stop finding these cool books. This one's really cool because of that like holographic hologram nope. cover. That's just my face. Oh. Oh yeah, there you go. It's really cool. It's like 3D. It looks like you mm -hmm. could step into it. And it's in the book throughout. Um, there's like different ones on the different pages. Yeah. And very, cool. very, very cool. So this is a cool book. So happy to have it. A fun pad. And you know what's funny, Janine? I didn't tell yeah. you this. I went to an estate sale this morning without Janine. And guess what was there? This? Yeah, I didn't get it though. You didn't pick it up? No. I know. That's peculiar. <laughs> but 
Why wouldn't you pick it? I don't know. I'm I kidding. thought about the one you had. Yeah, no, obviously. <laughs> I have one now. I don't need another one. This was Jenny's. Jenny wrote her name right there. Now it is it is Jenny's. Jenny's. Jenny, Jenny's. Yeah. Janine. Jenny. Jenny. Jenny's. Yep. Jenny's. Yours. Um, I don't think this was filled out at all. Really cool. Um, I'm really happy to have this as well. The other one we did a giveaway. Yes. Oh, not with. Yes. Yes. This Laura. is our second time finding it. Oh. Laura found the first one. Now I found the second one. I found so. the third, but I didn't pick yeah, it up. Yeah, you found a third? Uh, Maybe you've been... It's the year uh, of the fun pad. I don't know. It's, to... it's like you're finding all the spooky little books and the fun pads and everything. <laughs> What's next? So I got this Titleist visor uh, for $1.99. I'm going to put it on eBay. I could probably get $15 for it. So, yeah. You guys are going to have to help me out with this. Is this... Is this a mad ball? Is it a reproduction? Um, I know they like redid them in like, I'm gonna say like mid 2000s. I, I'm not quite sure. Is this a knockoff from back in the 80s? What is this? Is it just something someone got from Halloween four years ago and kept it under their bed and it looks disgusting? Um, I don't know. I think it's cool. I think it's gonna look cool on the shelf during Halloween, which is what I'm gonna do with it. But I need your help. Let me know, is this a mad ball? Is this a knockoff? Is it old? Is it new? What do you guys know? I know I was giving you a hard time in the thrift store, but I was I'm giving you a hard time in the thrift store. <laughs> I'm very excited that you found this. Yeah, this is cool because um, it's first of all, not chipped or broken. So any anytime you can find a ceramic at the thrift store that is not chipped, doesn't have any major damage or any major repairs, that is exciting. Another thing is that it was a dollar sixty nine. Yeah, that's fantastic. Fantastic price, and yeah, like Laura was saying, it's a Napco. She has found one in the past that was red, and now we found the green variety. Yep, and that's a newerish Napco sticker, the red and the gold, probably from the late sixties. Great find. Thank you. So I did find a couple of really cool. Uh, I think they were from. The 90s and 80s yeah the baby all gone that was made by kenner from 1991 she was the doll that you could feed the little food to and the food would retract into the spoon um she's worth money if you have the food that goes along with her so i didn't pick her up for that reason but it, she was in really good shape really cool to find her as well and then there was that i think it was called tuggins those were from the 80s also made by kenner and that was like the little baby or the doll to like a bigger doll. Um, there's a lot listed on eBay and not a lot sold. So I didn't pick that one up either. This little guy was really perplexing at the thrift store. Um, <laughs> I did a Google lens search and this is, had I lifted up his little ear, I would have seen he's a wrinkles. Let me see. Wrinkles. Wrinkles. You see that? Yeah. Um, he is marked on the back, made in China, 1986 by Gans. Um, I don't know what this is. So this is the PVC version. It was a plush back in the 80s. He makes this very interesting sound. Sounds like a dog. Toy. I don't know. It's just really different and fun. And um, I don't know what I'm going to do with him. Her, maybe eBay. Um, but she stood out to me in that bag. And my hunch was correct. She is definitely vintage. If you guys know wrinkles, drop a comment. Um, this was before my time. And I had never seen it before. So... Really cute, fun, and different. I've been putting my finger in here. I don't know what it's for. <laughs> and after much internal debating, I decided to get the melted popcorn, not popcorn, melted plastic smiley lamp. I'm actually pretty glad I did. He looks really cute. He's really fun. I'm happy that you got him. Guys, don't forget about our What Not Christmas ornament sale tonight. We went through all those ornaments from the trash and we realized there are so many. So this will be part one of a few sales with these ornaments. You're not going to want to miss it if you're eyeing a specific one. Um, so we hope to see you guys there. And even if you just join us to talk and hang out, we would love to have you. Thank you guys so much for joining us. See you next time. Bye. Bye.